Good evening. The Greenwich School District preparing for a worst case scenario in your child's classroom. District police teaming up with officers from West Valley City to practice taking down an active shooter. New specialist Lauren Steinbrecher gives us a look at the training and it comes on a day before a tragic and tough anniversary for the school district. Tomorrow will be a hard day for many families in the Granite School District, but today the focus was on how to keep kids safe in situations like that one. If this sound ever echoes inside school walls, Granite PD and West Valley City officers are buttoning down exactly what they'll do in those moments. Those that are arriving at the school first, where they're making a point of entry, how they're going throughout the school, whether that's classroom to classroom, uh, throughout the hallways. Moments not unlike what the district and police saw at Granger Elementary when explosions from a science experiment led to a huge police presence in November. Or nearly a year ago to the day at Hunter High School when a student shot and killed two others and injured a third just outside the school, leading to a lockdown. Instead of waiting for chaos, the nearly three dozen officers spent the day creating it in role-playing scenarios. We're going to get you taken care of, okay? It builds upon that muscle memory and uh, that routine so that should the unthinkable occur, we're as prepared as possible to deal with those situations and those different scenarios. Building up tactical strategy, communication, and collaboration. It gives us an opportunity to have a real-world-based training that's on location and it's hands-on. And with kids on break around the holiday weekend, the school empty. Today was a good opportunity to make sure Can you tell me your name? they're ready. You okay? With the anniversary of the shooting outside Hunter High, which happened just down the street from here a year ago, even if kids are not in school, the Granite School District says they will make counselors and mental health professionals available to students who may be struggling with that anniversary. Lauren Steinbrecher, KSL 5 News. Good to see they're getting that training. Lauren, thank you.